Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. If you are new around here, hi, I'm Madeline and I'm so happy that you are here today. Thank you for clicking on my video. Today is going to be my moving out of my college apartment vlog. I took a couple clips of me packing some stuff up that I'm going to include right here. And I packed up a lot more that I didn't take videos of. I'm gonna show you how plain my room looks right now. You've got nothing on the dresser. All of my drawers are empty. I need to wipe them down and stuff and clean them, but all my wall stuff is down except this and my lights. Some of that's going in my car and then my closet is almost completely empty. That is her. So most of my stuff is actually in my car. The microwave just went off. I'm making a really quick bowl of mac and cheese with some tuna. That's one of my favorite lunches. I made a bowl of that really quick and we are gonna go ahead and get on the road. We are loaded up in the car. I have a ton of stuff. She is filled to the brim and this is not even all of my stuff. I saw stuff in my apartment. I'm moving home over the course of two days. I'm moving most of my stuff home today and um, I'm coming back up. I think I'm gonna bring my mom's car because I have some furniture to bring home. And then I am officially moving home on Tuesday, so this vlog is going to be split up into a couple days. Yeah, this is all of my major stuff, like my bedding and some furniture and like just a bunch of random stuff is um, still in my apartment. She is very full. I can still see out all my windows that are important, so we should be good to drive. But I am officially heading home. Today is Friday. I'm going to stay at my parents' house Friday and Saturday, drive back up Sunday because I work, work Monday, take my final Tuesday, and then I am officially, officially moving out. I am so, so excited. I'm over school this semester and school year in general was just so much if you're in college or in school at all, really. My college did not do spring break this year, and that was, not getting a break was really, really rough. I don't even do anything for spring break. Like, I just like to go home and relax, and I did not get for those of you that are wondering, I never said this, but I go to IUPUI, which is Indiana University, Purdue University of Indianapolis. We are in downtown Indy. I'm majoring in exercise science, minoring in health psychology and personal training. And yeah, that is basically all my college stuff you need to know. I don't know if this car has a weight limit. I drive a Volkswagen Bug, if you don't know. And it is very, very, very full right now. But funny story, my car was even fuller than this. One of my roommates last semester in November got COVID like a week before we were sent home. So we all just like moved out right then that day. And I had so much stuff in this car that I thought it like wasn't gonna move. So I am gonna go ahead and start driving and I will talk to you guys when I get home. I just made it home. I don't think any of my family is home, so that's awkward, but my dog is here and she honestly will probably be the most excited to see me, so. <gasps> oh my goodness, hello, baby. <laughs> hello. <laughs> hello. It's a few hours later. I'm here in my room trying to get it cleaned up before I move my stuff and I have all these clothes I need to take care of. I'm gonna get my room cleaned up now and start moving stuff back in. So I have unloaded my car. This is what we are working with. So much stuff 
I lit a candle. That's Donut Shop by DW Home. I've talked about that brand before. But yeah, lots of stuff to do. It is currently like 9, 9.30ish. And we took Winnie on a walk and I got wind burnt. I don't know if you can see that. I got literally wind burnt. But believe it or not, this is progress. My closet is now full of my clothes. I need to declutter that. But this is all clothes that are going downstairs that are like long sleeves and winter stuff. Honestly, once all this stuff that's going downstairs is out of here, we're doing really good. So I'm going to keep doing this. I'm trying to get it done before I go to bed tonight, but we'll see if that happens. I need to at least get my bed cleared off. Got a lot of stuff on my bed right now. Slowly but surely we are unpacking. I'm going to get back to it. Hi guys. Happy Sunday. It is a few days later. I'm about to drive back up to Indy, but this is the current state of my room. We still have a lot of stuff to do. I have to put all that away. Untangle some necklaces. I just have a couple things still out. This is a mess because I did prom makeup this weekend. So that is why I'm not vlogging again until today, which is Sunday. I'm about to load up actually my mom's car because I have like side tables and a coffee car and like all this stuff that I have to bring home that I didn't think about. That's not going to fit in my car. So we are taking my mom's car to go up back up to school. I'm getting the rest of my stuff. I'm going to grab my sunglasses. I think I have everything sitting in the kitchen that I need to go put in my mom's car. Sorry, I didn't vlog all yesterday. I kind of wanted this to just be like moving out of my apartment and moving back into my parents' house kind of vlog. And um, yesterday I literally unpacked nothing. I didn't clean anything. I just did like prom makeup and hung out with Ian and went to prom walk-ins and stuff. Miss Winnie girl here. is about to have to go in her kennel so I can leave because no one's here. Hi, Winnie, you want to say hi to the vlog? Say hi. Hi, big girl. <gasps> say hello, vlog. Hello, YouTube. Do you remember Winnie from my Vlogmas videos? She's literally like, ooh, lighting. Winnie's doubled in size since Vlogmas, so she is huge now. I'm going to pack up my mom's car because it is after 10, and I wanted to leave a little bit after 10. So this is all the stuff that's coming back with me i just have a couple things to put into bags i look a little bit rough i just got off work it is currently well i didn't just get off work i got off work at five and i walked the canal which is about three miles and it is now 6 15 i just made it back to my apartment building and i got a really good parking spot i am praying i don't get a parking ticket because um i'm in my mom's car because i think i said this earlier in the vlog but i have a lot of like bigger furniture pieces to pack home and i drive a volkswagen butt that was just really not gonna cut it so i had to take my mom's car my mom drives a mercedes-benz r350 and those are huge i feel like i'm driving a school bus right now i am going to unload my stuff it's raining out and i just don't feel like carrying a bunch of stuff in or making more than one trip anyways um yeah, I'm going to go ahead and head in my apartment and chill. I will probably pack more tomorrow, so that's where I will pick up this video. But, yeah, I am back on campus. I've been doing lots of driving these past couple days, and I won't even be here for 48 hours, and I will be heading back home. So, I am heading back home Tuesday morning. You guys will see that in this vlog, so I don't know why I'm explaining it. But I'm going to go ahead and head on inside. Hello, you guys, and welcome to part two of this vlog. It is Tuesday morning, almost 8 o'clock. I have a final I need to leave for at 8.30, but um, I'm about to start packing up the rest of my room, and um, the light in my ceiling went out. I don't know why. So that is why I'm using my makeup mirror lights to start off this vlog. Um, I did, as you can see, like my lights and my tapestry are down and stuff. I did pack up some stuff yesterday, and honestly, I just forgot to record it, but that's not even anything really interesting. I just have a little bit of stuff remaining in here that I need to go take out. I have 30 minutes until I need to leave for my final, so we're going to see what all I can get out in 30 minutes. My bathroom is completely cleaned out. Um, most of my kitchen stuff is cleaned out. I just need to take my food out of the fridge and stuff. And then I just have these couple things remaining in my bedroom. 
and we are ready to skirt on out of here. What sucks is that um, <clears throat> my final is at nine. I come home. I'm a very fast test taker, so it will not take me long to take my exam at all. But my office to turn my keys into does not open up until 11, so that delays me going home, which is fine because it's just going to be like an hour or so, but... So I'm not too stressed about getting everything packed up right now, plus I need to um, wipe everything down and stuff just so I don't get any fees for leaving it dirty. I'm going to pack up my bedding and figure out where I'm going to put my bathroom shower curtain and towels and rugs and stuff. Get all that taken out to my car. And that just leaves me with a bunch of random little things that need taken out. So. We are going to go ahead and get started. So this is all that is left in here. I got to leave to go take my camp final now and then I will be back and then pack everything up, wipe everything down. Hopefully that'll get me to 11 and I can turn my keys in and we are out of here. And here she is all empty. I just have to take some trash out, load up my food. Take that stuff out, and we are all ready to go. I am pretty much all moved out. Here we are, full to the brim. Not really sure how driving is gonna work. Just hoping nothing will fall out. We are stuffed in here, but I am waiting to drive on over and turn in my keys. And then we are ready to head out. I am so, so excited. This year was just not it. This year was not it. I think everyone can agree with me on that. Sorry, my story just uploaded. Um, this year was just a rough one. And I am just so ready to be done. I passed my chemistry class. Had that final this morning. And then I have one, two, three... Three more exams and one final project due. And then I am a junior in college, which is so, so weird. I am almost halfway done with my college degree. Thank goodness, because I am over it already. But I'm going to go ahead and get started on going over to turn in my keys. We're going to get some Starbucks because it is much deserved. And we are going to head on over. So I got some Starbucks. Look how yummy it looks. It's like... I don't know how to describe it. I got a venti iced coffee, light ice, vanilla, sweet cream, cold foam, three pumps of vanilla, sugar-free vanilla, and light cream. I normally do not get the foam. Sometimes I like to treat myself because the foam just slaps, but I know this isn't healthy, so I try not to get it a lot. It was a little bit after 11. And I'm just so excited to go home, so we're going to go ahead and go home. It is raining, so I'm hoping traffic is not too bad. I just stopped at a gas station right off the interstate, so I'm officially done interstate driving. I'm like... 25 30 minutes away from my house and this gas station has a Dairy Queen in it and let me tell you Dairy Queen is like my number one weakness I freaking love a hot fudge sundae from Dairy Queen smacks but I did not get anything and I just need to pee really quick because venti iced coffee was starting to hit you guys I am home and in my room my mom did my laundry so I need to fold that and put that away and then we are gonna start unloading the car I'm gonna finish I'm gonna clean up everything in here first and then start unloading stuff because if I don't clean first I will get so so overwhelmed my mom freaking plugged me with the she got me some Milani news she got me comic stardust which I'm very excited to try I think this is like supposed to be berries 
I don't really know, but I've heard it's good. And then my fave, Hawaiian Shave Ice. So she got me a couple of those. Also, this is so random, but look how cute my new sheets are. My mom got me these leopard print sheets. Okay, y'all, I had to shut my door because my brother is watching Star Wars because it's Star Wars Day when I'm filming this. It's May 4th. Happy Star Wars Day, whatever. I have a lot of stuff that needs to go downstairs into storage in the kitchen, but this is all I have left to do in my room. It's honestly not too bad compared to the first time. This is just a drying rack. And then like I have stuff on my bed. Yes, I have stuffed animals. Pretty girls sleep with stuffed animals. Look how crooked my fingers are. It's not a joke. I don't think this will honestly take me too long. What's gonna take forever is hauling all the stuff downstairs because it is heavy stuff. So my brother might have to help me. But shout out to Mason for helping me bring all my stuff in the house and out of my mom's car. It is several, several hours later. It's like nine o'clock. It's nighttime now. And this is what I have so far. My school stuff needs kind of sorted and some of that will go downstairs. Some of that will stay up here because I do have a summer class. Makeup desk really needs cleaned, but it is cleaned off. And then I just have my little bedside table. My bed is nice and clear. All this stuff is hung back up. This corner is just a mess. I need to work on that. All that stuff. Those need a home. I need to untangle some necklaces. That got hung up. Ian just texted me. For the most part, I am moved back. Well, not for the most part. I'm completely moved back in. My room just needs clean. I need to like sweep and wipe off stuff all of my stuff is here most of it's put away very excited and grateful to be home but i'm just gonna go ahead and end the vlog right here because i need to edit this and get it up because it goes up tomorrow because i am irresponsible and my schedule got messed up whatever but i need to get this up tomorrow so i'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here so i can get to editing i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog if you did please give it a thumbs up so that i know leave a comment down below and subscribe to my channel and make sure that you hit the notification bell so you don't miss an upload from me